Right, welcome back to Silma. Welcome back to Cruise Control, and welcome back to watching me stumble my way through this game like a fucking idiot. So, uh, yeah, last episode I wasted far too much time getting down into this drainage pipe. So let's see where it takes us. It doesn't look like this is way is gonna go anywhere. Also, my vision seems to be a little blurred from the fall. I don't know if that's showing up real well or not. Oh yeah, definitely. Things are a little blurry at the moment. But that's what this thing's for. Yeah, don't be shy. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. That's more like it. <clears throat> yeah, you know, I didn't really realize how profound that, uh, that blurred vision effect was until now. Anyway, why don't we try pulling this lever? Lover, emergency flush. <coughs> uh, sorry guys, I'm still a little bit sick. Here we go. That didn't sound good. Oh god. Well, uh, alright, sure. We. That scared the shit out of me. I actually thought that was a monster. Yeah, it could have been. It's always a monster. God, where the fuck am I? I like that I'm making panicked breathing noises, even though I don't breathe. I never even thought about that before. Oh, I got an achievement. What do we got here? I feel like that was Catherine's voice, uh, the woman talking in that flashback. Okay, so I'm definitely not going back this way. Eh, anything up here to look at? Wait, can I actually, like, walk back through here? Fuck it, I'm gonna see how far I can go. No way. Oh, wow. Oh, that's about as far as I can go. Okay. Well, it was fun trying. I guess. So yeah, I guess. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go now. Like, I mean, obviously that way. I just mean, like, as far as what my current goal in the story is, I guess just try and get to the abyss, right? There's like an elevator there or something. Something to do about taking us to the Ark. That I know for sure. Uh, oh, this is really pretty. Oh. Alright. Let's find Omicron. Who? Cool. What are those things? Like, hmm. Like sensor arrays or. something of that nature? Or are they getting power somehow? Oh, yeah. Okay. So. I wonder if I have to find one of these things that still works. Power failure, power, fa power failure, power failure everywhere. Oh, I see lights over there. I see health over here. Ooh, what do we got here? Aww, that's actually kind of, kind of sad. It's a little robot guy. Okay. We seem to be getting somewhere here. Hmm. What do we got over here? Can I go inside? Looks like I can. Let's give this a shot. Oh, this is offline. Oh! Okay. Oh, Ooh, what do we got here? There's a lever. 
button? Can I push the button? I can't push the button. Uh, oh, what do I got here? Oh, that seems to be locked. Okay. That's also locked. Manual override? Oh, here we go. Oh boy. Warning, before flushing, make sure to open valves and turn on the pump. Okay. So... Can I... Huh. What does this button do? No, no, I don't want to flush yet. Oh, I think that turned the power on to everything else, though. Okay. Awesome. Maybe I'm actually going to do this right. Alright, let's flush this shit down the drain. Ooh, cool. Er, uh, uh, ah, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh boy. I don't like the sound of that. My heartbeat is like racing. Wait, why do I have a heartbeat? I never thought about that until now. Why the fuck do I have a heartbeat? Catherine? What? Oh, there you are. Where are we? We're right next to Omicron, a smaller building connected to the main site. Can't you tell? No, my view is pretty limited. There's some heavy restrictions on my system access. Did you find a power suit? Not yet. I'm trying to figure out how to get into Omicron, the big building. Oh, okay. Keep up the good work. That's it? You got nothing? Good luck. Thanks. <laughs> You're very helpful, Kat. Good job. Kat, how are you so okay with all this? With what? Being a talking box, for one thing. Not being human. That's not so bad. So, you're not bothered at all by not having a body? I'm getting there. You're making me feel really self-conscious. Come on. Be serious. I never felt that comfortable being human in the first place. This isn't much worse. Not being able to move would freak me out. Yeah, being a people sucks. Would make it a little easier to help out if I had a body. I wish I wasn't a people. Just figured being able to stretch a little would give you some ease. My physical constraints don't translate to my experience very well. I feel about as human as before, but as if suspended in air. Which is kind of interesting now that I think about it. I guess so. What do we got here? Huh. Do you who this is? Not really. Not that familiar with the people at Omicron. Oh, we got papers. Papers, papers, nothing. Kath, why do you think I was made? Why would this AI, the WoW, bring me here? I don't think we could ever know. I have my own beliefs, but nothing that can be verified. Tell me, why do you think the WoW brought me here? The WoW had a range of assignments, but they all sprung from one single idea. Preserve humanity. When the comet hit the Earth, killing everything, leaving a fraction of humanity left alive, the WoW started to compensate. It's restoring humanity. I think so, but I don't think we share its definition of human. Or life, for that matter. Whoa, what is this? Oh god, it's some sort of puzzle. Fuck me. Catherine, are we alive? That's an impossible question to answer. We lack meaningful definitions. I just figured there must be a way to know. You know if this life is worth living. You assume you've changed so much, but have you really? I don't know. I don't feel so different. But the world sure does. I never realized how much the idea of myself depended on where I am. How do you mean? I miss Toronto. And not because my friends and family are there, but because I know where I fit in. In Toronto, 
I know who I am. That's an interesting observation. Hmm. Whoa. That's not good. Oh boy. So, what am I supposed to be doing here? I guess I don't need those broken ones. Whoa. Whoa. What did I just do? Uh. Okay. So. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm not entirely sure what my goal is here. Can I get a better look at this thing? Ugh, not really. It's tough to see. Hmm. So it looks like I want to get it to the bottom right. As far as I can tell. Okay, so it's going to have to come in through here. That much is obvious. Hmm. But that's not really working out. Wait, here we go. Oh, the terminal just lit up. Well, that wasn't too bad. It's actually probably one of the easiest puzzles I've done so far. Ooh, now which terminal? I'll go by Catherine here. Radio buffer. Boomer, do we have any painkillers left? This tinnitus is becoming crippling. Uh, Sorry, tinnitus sounds like the worst. I'll take it. Feels like my head is about to explode. Can do. That's stuff for emergencies. Besides, Cameron thinks the ringing will settle when JR reaches 100%. Then tell him to hurry the fuck up. Should be a matter of hours. Just hang in there. Keep me posted. Yeah, well, uh, I have this thing I need to take care of, so I'll talk to you later, okay? Sure thing, Herb. He must have overloaded his black box. Humans have black boxes? Here we do. Company policy. It records your vitals to help medical personnel treat you in case of accidents. That's how I can hear the dead. Right. Yeah, you should be able to data mine black boxes, just like the intercom is made of. Hmm, okay. Well, that's one mystery solved. Omicron, status, quarantine. Whoa, what? There has to be a way to cancel the lockdown. Have a look around the room. Sure. So first off, let's look at this other computer screen. Black box, Did whoa. You that, what? Never mind. What the fuck? Oh, do we got, uh, do we got Catherine in here? Hmm, I don't see him. Hmm. System updates. Oh, God. Updating those black boxes. Something, something. This is a bunch of tech stuff. Hmm. Yeah, none of that seems important. Whoa. Uh, assaulted. Assault what? Why do we get the feeling that we just got lured into the back of a van? I what did are you it. Talking about? Oh boy. Yeah, that that's very alarming. So nine nine oh nine. I gotcha. I can take a hint. I did it. Omicron retracted the quarantine shutters. Lockdown canceled. Something wants us to come inside. We want to go inside. What's the problem? Come on, let's get going. All right. I don't like this one bit. To quote Star Wars, I've got a bad feeling about this. Boy, Force Awakens was a fun movie. I mean, it wasn't perfect. I have no problems with it. But man, that was a fun movie. Let's see. Adam Kalaski is ordered to come to Theta as soon as possible. Urgent. Oh. 
ask. I tried to figure out what it was about, but they wouldn't tell me anything. All I know is they asked if you were missing or if you were dead. Something must freak them out. I think you better do as they tell you. Herbie. Hmm. So, I get the feeling at least some of them knew that there was some freaky shit going on already. Or, wait, no, this is... I can't remember if this is before or after the WoW went berserk. I'm getting my timelines all confused now. So I'm guessing I have to go back out of here to uh, actually get into Omicron. Or... Wait. Uh... Okay. I see. I just need to bring in the water again. Uh, the water effects are pretty cool in this game. I have to give it props. And here we go. Okay, so Omicron... Oh, here's another dead guy. Answer to anything. What kind of cold hearted motherfuckers would just leave us out here to die? Don't you get it? They're dead. They're all dead. Yeah. You're right. How can you be so calm about this shit? We are dying. How much air have you guys got? 20 minutes. Tops. Hey, I'm in red. Seconds away before the CO2 gets me. Strasky. Why wait, right? I'm the master of my own fate. Wait, Stress, what are you doing? <laughs> Well, that was fun, listening to someone drown, I'm assuming. Oh, is that it down there? Is that where I want to be? Oh, listen to this music. It's gotten all unsettling all of a sudden. Also, hey, robot buddy. Wait, my vision's getting a little fucked up. Oh, I think it does even when I'm next to a friendly robot. Now that I think about it. Alright, Omicron. I'm home. Oh. Hey, come on! Open up! What is this shit? Are for the apocalypse? Omicron is in quarantine. This is why they didn't answer our call. Hello! Christ, Strasky, it's called a radio. They're not gonna hear you better if you scream. Jonesy, are you okay? Look, I know you're the strong silent type, but I need you to say something every now and then so I know you're all right. Jonesy? Jones. Open up! Fuck's sakes. Let's try the annex again. Maybe we can break in. We're losing Jonesy. We need to get her inside. Oh, get in line! Alvaro, there's nothing we can do for her right now. Hit the stasis switch and let's check the annex. <sighs> this game's depressing as fuck. I mean, that's not a complaint, it's just a statement. Depressing as fuck. Alright! Well, I'm gonna I think Omicron is where we need to get the power suit. Oh, wait. What's happening? Mech malfunction, use alternate entrance. Uh. Wait. What? Huh. Alternate entrance, you say? And where would this be? So, do I need to just leave? Hmm. Can I go down here? Oh yeah, there's gonna be stuff over here. Oh, fuck. There we go. Oh god. Alright, I gotta be careful here. Whoa. Alright. This had better be the right way. Oh, this is... Oh boy. Alright. 
Not fun. Not fun. Ah, there we go. Okay. Why... Oh, why is my screen freaking out? I really don't like that. Okay. Can I go in here? Please? Here we go. So, I mean, it's guaranteed there's going to be a monster in there. So apparently there's mods for this game that just straight up, like, disable the monsters or even take them out completely. For people who don't like the kind of hide-and-seek gameplay. And that seems alright, actually. I'm, I'm not huge on that. I'm not a huge on the actual gameplay, to be honest. I, uh... It's fine. It does what it needs to do, I guess. I'm just not super into it. Oh, is that because the head's gone? Was the black box in the head? I don't know. Everything's fucked. How about you? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and guess it's definitely the head. Oh, oh boy. So I can go up. Or I can go in here. Oh man. It's a lot of choices. Global Lockdown Active, Override Dive Room Console. Oh, gross. More of that goo. Alright, dive room, huh? So the question is, where's the dive room? Also, what's this shit? Uh, just tools, okay. Oh, looks like I'm going upstairs. So, what's the monster going to be like this time? I guess, mechanically, they all behave pretty much the same. Oh boy. Uh, can I see it out there? I'm not sure. Hmm. I don't hear anything anymore. Oh, but I can hear something. What? The fuck was that? What? What the shit? Whoa. That was... What is happening? Oh my god, this music. Oh my god. Oh. I simultaneously love and hate this game. Cause man... Like, I am... I'm a big baby, man. I, I do not deal with, like, horror very well. And this game just keeps getting creepier and creepier as it goes along. It's really starting to fuck with me. Oh, I can't go in there. Okay. I guess I'll just keep going. Oh, why? Why am I playing this? Why am I LPing this so you can all see me be the baby man I am? Well, what do we got in here? Monsters! Hello? Oh, fuck. I just... I know it's gonna show up. Like... 
the question is when and where, and will I be able to hide in time when it does? Oh. Just, it's feeling me down one path. There's been only one way I can go this whole time. Which is weird, considering how many doors there are. Makes me wonder if I'll be exploring everything later, or if they're just kind of trying to give the illusion of a larger space. Whoa. Okay. No, that's not good. I started hearing weird noises. I don't know if... Uh. Oh, hey, it's those guys again. I remember that picture. That's the power suit guide again. Uh, oh, here we go. Team checklist. Test the suits tested and ready. Scans in the arc. Load equipment. Climber calibrated. Crane operator ready. Mm okay. So, they were working in here, that's for sure. Oh, here we go. Uh, is this Omicron? Everything is so basic, so limited. I hope it's not the Amatool falling apart. Okay, we need to find you a power suit, you know, so we can go into the abyss without ending up like a recycled can of soda. You think we'll find one that fits me? I mean... Kind of in a suit already. That's been bothering me too. I thought you know, we covered this already. From Vancouver, Toronto. From then to now. Didn't you say the suit should be big enough anyway? Okay, so we do it again. You want to send me to the future? No, you idiot. I want to transfer your mind into a new body. Oh god. We already know it can be done. We don't need to make it a big deal. It is a big deal, Kath. It's a huge fucking deal. There's got to be something oh. else that can take us down there. But Dunbat at Theta was the only vessel that could take that pressure, and you saw what happened. Then think of something else. Simon, please. You don't have to switch this instant. Just play along for now. If we find something else, then great. If not... I'm not promising anything. Thank I mean, you, I don't blame Simon here. Although Catherine's are right as time. well. Like, neither one of them is wrong. That's kind of... Oh, cool. Well, I think it's puzzle time. Alright, what do we got here? Airlock. Reminder, check your air supply and systems. Oh boy. Activate terminal? Heh, <laughs> that's pretty cool. Okay, what did that do? Nope, here we go. Or, nope, nothing. So there must be more I have to do around here. Hey, boots. Fuck your boots. What the fuck is this? What are you waiting for? Find a power suit and let's get on with this. Okay, I'm trying. Okay, no suit. No suit. No suit. Oh, here we go. Oh. Oh, no. I found one of the power suits. Oh, uh, Herber. At least I think it's a woman. Oh. It's like the body we found in the annex. She's missing her head. Gross. This could work in our favor, though. Look for a terminal nearby. See if you can boot it up. That was fucking disgusting. Man. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Just twisted her head off. Alright, power suit. Information, high pressure power suit guaranteed to withstand temperature spanning from 50 to minus 75. Yeah, Celsius, real temperature. That's right, I said it. While well, keeping a steady 40 degree on the inside. The suit will automatically shield the wearer from pressure and maintain the normal... Okay, this is all tech information. Seasonally assembled through rotating neck and wrist rings. 
blah, blah, blah. More tech stuff. Let's get an onboard computer. Okay, that could be important. Tracking. Interesting. So... Yeah, okay. So, does this mean that there's one somewhere else? Hmm. Uh, I believe D? Not exactly grade A material. Don't write it off just yet. Remember what we found out at Theta. The suit you are wearing is basically just a Cortex chip working in kinds of structure gel powered by the on-suit battery pack. And a dead column, Imogen Reed. Exactly. If you think about it, we're actually incredibly lucky. We found a suit with an already dead body inside. Oh, this man. Suit. What about the wow? What makes you think it'll play along? It's not magic, it's algorithms. A set pattern. The wow won't be able to deny us, even if it was capable of wanting to. I'm still not crazy about this plan. It feels wrong. Please, Simon. I can't give up on the Ark. I need this to work. So we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a battery pack. That's one hell of a shopping list. Thanks. I'll just hang around here if that's okay. I'll be back. Okay. So I need to go find all this bullshit. Alright. This is where the monster's gonna show up. Yeah, I might as well check these other doors while I'm here. Nope. Nothing. Nope. Nothing. You stay open. Well, what do we got here? Okay, this will be my exit once I get the suit. Understood. Can I talk to you some more, Kate? No? Oh, yeah, I can. Come on, we need to get a Cortex chip, a battery pack, and some structure gel. Yeah, yeah. Okay, no way, it's just gonna be in the loggers, and that never happens. Of course, no, I said that. That's absolutely what's gonna happen. Absolutely going to be what will happen, is what I mean. Me speak English good. Okay. Time to get hunted by the monster. So. What do you got in here? North Hall, F2. Yeah, let's actually get into stealth mode right this second. What's in here? Oh, am I actually going to have to search this shit? I feel like, yeah, there'd be like a special crab icon if it was actually something. Oh, come on. Okay, I guess nothing here. Right. The search continues, I suppose. I'm gonna cut through this room. Well, these textures are kind of freaking out a little bit. Weird. So, what do we got here? Cortex chip, structure gel, and what? Oh, fuck, I forget already. Oh, wait. Nope. Hmm, the computer doesn't seem to really be doing anything. What about... Looks like there's more going on in this room now. Maybe. Or maybe not. Hmm. Uh, why is this game so goddamn intense? Like, I'm just doing a fetch quest, and I'm freaking the fuck out. Hmm. 
Hmm. Uh, like, I'm hearing little whispers and little squirms and everything is terrible. Oh, hey. Ruffy, chicken palperin. An unusually sedated orange Ruffy found hovering outside Omicron substation. Had a remarkable bone growth that seemed to interfere with its perception. Brought it inside to study it, but it stiffened and died in the process. During post-mortem study, the thing kicked back to life while being out of water. It kept swinging for a few minutes, so I returned it to an aquarium and instantly started banging into the glass and bludgeoned itself to death before I could relocate it. Ooh. Shelly, dead on arrival. Entry by Claudia Ames. Darby and Waldeck identified as what was sabotaging the Lumar probe at about 900 meters depth. It's a 150 centimeter long rudderfish that looks like it has emerged with some other kind of fish or shark. It's the freakiest form of mutation we've seen so far. It's clear that it's getting worse. Something is causing this, and I'm not buying the radioactive fallout nonsense that Ovari can't shut up about. Johan Ross, dead on arrival. Claudia again. The dead man found on the climber this morning has been identified as Johan Ross, the AI psychologist working at Tau. I can't even begin to imagine what has happened down in the abyss, and frankly, I won't risk losing my staff by going down there to look. If the ARC team is alive, which I highly doubt, they will have to find a way to give us a sign. We're not going down there again without good reason. Okay. So we got some added, uh, some added context, some added lore there. Oh man, where am I even going right now? Like, can this uh, bring me back downstairs? It wouldn't surprise me if there's something over there I need to go check out, but let's look over here. Hmm. Anything? So I'm guessing that the uh, computer flipping out like that, or my vision, has something to do with the WoW, like my interface with it. Because it doesn't happen just with the monsters, it happens with a lot of uh, the other systems that presumably are connected to the WoW. So it seems like the WoW's influence in general is uh, fucking with me. Like, really hard. Okay, so... So that's where I came in. I know I got this computer over here. I'm just kind of taking a look around. So... Can I use this computer now? Oh, what? Listen to me? Hmm. Whoa, what the fuck? Uh... What am I doing? Whoa. Whoa. I'm super confused right now. What is happening? So, oh, do I need to, like, put a line through all of that? Stop the wow. <laughs> ah, shit. Okay. So, I, I think I know what to do for this puzzle. God, this is really starting to fuck with me. Okay. Gotta focus. Gotta concentrate. Okay. So, let's try that. destroy the wow okay 
Well, I seem to be doing better at the puzzles. So, that's nice to see. So where am I? I'm in the lower section? Hmm. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, man. Oh, I'm really scared to go in here. Oh, robot repair bay. Well, I'm sure I'll find some of what I need in there. So something's trying to contact me. That's obvious enough. And my vision's getting a little blurred again. At least I thought it was. Cortex chip diagnostics? What? Whoa. What? I'm really confused. So... Okay. So... Do I need to, like, connect all of this? I'm really, really... Oh. What the fuck is happening? All of this seems horrifying. Holy fuck. So, am I just really fucking with this thing's head? Oh man. I feel kinda terrible. Oh, I did it, I guess? Hooray! I win the game. Oh, alright. Blueprints. Hmm, so is that all I got in here? I guess so. You got some maths over there. Alright, one... One quest objective done, I guess. I'm really shocked there's been no monster yet. Oh, but there's this guy. Hi. Oh, look at his chest. Fuck. That's some brutal shit. So, computers... Oh, oh what do we got here? The heart of Alpha? Okay. Find Tau, find Alpha, take the cell to... Take the gel to Alpha? Okay, so Alpha is something important, apparently. Hmm. Whoa. Oh, hey, there's one of my, my health friends. Into the Abyss. Take it to Alpha in the Abyss. Okay. So, gel. Oh, we got some audio logs. Let's listen to these. I hear you, Herbie. What's up? Uh, just wanted to check in. I have to go do something. I might not be around for a few days, okay? Rally her relieving the listening post? Must be important. It is, Strask. It is. Well, okay, then. Stay safe. Hmm. Omicron, can you hear us? Loud and clear. Everyone all right? As 
What the fuck was that noise? It was like a whale, but... Tau, please respond. This is Rowley Herber calling from Omicron. Please respond, Tau. Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Get the... get the virus? Unable to connect. Lumar relay out of range. Hmm... Well, hey, a stress ball. That seems useful right now. You know what? I'm gonna go for this. Maybe I'll start freaking out a little less. Oh! Oh boy. What did I do? Uh. Oh. Shit. That's not good. Also, I totally... Listen to me. Oh man, even on these computer monitors, it's freaking out. Okay, but is there really... Nothing in here I can take? Hmm. I really thought the gel was going to be in there. Looks like there's a whole bunch of messages about the gel. No drawers, nothing? Really? Huh. Weird. Hmm. Well, you know what, guys? Uh, I think maybe I'm gonna call it here. So, uh, next time, join me and we'll continue to, uh, hopefully get this power suit working and we can get the fuck out of here and figure out what all this cryptic bullshit messaging is about. So until next time, I'll see you in a couple days, and thanks for watching.